Professor Olivier? Professor Olivier? Hey. Hello, hello, hello. Professor Olivier? I'm coming, hello. B where, where are you? Oh, right, I'm, I'm, I'm coming up. I'm coming up. Uh, hello, oh. hello. Oh, I'm so excited, Dan. Thank you for coming. I, I, and we're getting started off on our journey to the center of the Internet. Thank you for joining me on this trip so much. Well, thank you for inviting me. I've got my tools with me. I, I just wanted to show you I, I brought my tools. What are we doing on top of this mountain anyway? Uh, we're going to go to the site just now, you the, know. The, the what? The site. The site to get yes, to the, dude, the center of the sure, Internet, yes, you know? know. Yeah. But look, I've, I've got my flashlight and... Um, uh, <laughs> Oh, and a, a knife, you can always use a knife on such a journey, and, and I'm going to be eating these pleasurable meals that I brought my, my lovely, expensive... Um, <coughs> Professor Olivier, and a, there's, there, there's kind of a problem. What, what's wrong? Those tools, we won't really be using those tools. Why not? Um, Where's, because this is a journey to the center of the internet. Oh, okay, so... Yeah. Oh, well, oh, man, just, oh, 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 oh. thank you, oh, shoot, whoa, so, so, I'm, oh, hello, everybody, thank you for having uh, Professor Elder here today, oh, we're going man. to uh, get started on our journey, and I, I brought all my stuff, and apparently I brought the wrong things, what, what uh, did I need? Uh, well, really, you need a mouse, and a keyboard. To do what? In order to get to the center of the internet. Where, where is the center? Thank you very much. Oh, yes, this is, this is so you can hear me very well. Thank yeah. you. He also needs that. Yes, I mean, thank you very yeah. much. Yeah. But my bag looks nice, though. Don't, don't I look like I'm ready for a journey? Fashionable, fashionable. <laughs> <laughs> so what, what, what do we need at the end to get started? Well, first to get started. I, mean, I heard a number of students have started blogs, right? They're yeah. blogs, and now they want to get them... Ready for their, they, they, and they're, they've hopefully registered for DS106, right? The, the, that's the, the fantastic site that you awesome. can, uh, you, you should fix that right there and get to the DS106 site, right? Yeah, right there. Get to, no, that's not the DS106 site. Well, no, this is not the DS106 site. It's the, that's it, the first tab. There you go. Yeah. And scroll up. There you go. Oh, yes, the DS106 site. Yes, now to watch your Who <laughs> So what, now okay. all our students have got their blogs, and, and hopefully they have, and, 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 and they've registered. But what kind of tools did they really need? I, I thought that, you know, my little merit badges would have been great. Well, you need a Twitter account and a Flickr account as well. Yes, uh, okay, yes. And so what can they do with those with their site? Well, with Twitter, you can actually have regular feeds. Like, I can talk to you, and you can talk to me, and we can... You know, be great friends and stuff. No, I'm joking. There are other things you could do with it. Seriously. There are, um, there are, hmm, some special tools. I heard there's some, well, well how, do you, how, do you, how do you get these tools to work in your, oh, oh, we, we did, oh, there we are. Oh, my goodness, we disappeared for a second. So how do we get, now, now that's the background. How do we get these tools, get access to these tools to make them work with our blogs? Well, we need to access the dashboard of our site, could, also known as the dashboard for WordPress. Oh, could you show that to us? Sure. Well, wait, whose site are we going to look at? Well, right now we're going to look at Professor... Smith's website. Yes, that's my colleague, Professor Smith. That's yeah. lovely. Oh, it's so nice that he, he, he's letting you use his site. What, is, what, what does he have? Oh, it's... Oh, that's... Oh, no. Uh, no. Is that? No. No. Oh, oh, there, that's it. No, no. Okay. Why don't you show us his site? So, his site... Oh, wait, let me, let me get a tool here. Oh, yes. Okay, go ahead. Oh, wow, now we keep disappearing again. <laughs> Here we are. <laughs> so he okay. has his site. What are these nice things he has on the side of his site? Could you show that? To talk about that. See, these right here on the right side of his website. Oh, there's over here. dancing in the middle. That's beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> these are called widgets. A whatcha? Wi widgets. Oh, lovely. What's a widget? A widget is like a, a certain thing that you can get really quick access to certain other things. It's a space that you can place on your site. Yeah, and you can place any random what thing What kind of things? I, I see he has a Flickr thing there. What's yeah, that? Yeah, well, Flickr, it's not really spelt right. No, I'm joking. Um, Flickr is basically how you're going to feed pictures from, say, I don't know, DS106. So all those lovely right here. pictures I put on, on Flickr, I could put on my site, too, automatically? Yeah. It does it all by itself. That's amazing. You can just set it up to feed right here. What, what about down there? Down here... 
These are tweets, not like the birds. Tweets, you know. Oh, how did he make those go on his site? He got another widget. Oh, a widget widget. Yeah. Great. What, wow, what's that man's face? That um, looks terrible. Yeah, I, I don't know. They're, uh... And Digo? <laughs> <laughs> okay, um, Digo. Hmm. That's a that's social a question. Question. bookmarking site. Oh, that's other than delicious, right? Yeah. So all the links that uh, Professor uh, uh, Professor Smith. Smith, Michael Branson Smith, was to share. Oh, I, I've done that. I well, no, I haven't. But he does. He that. did. That's it. great. The, the yes. other. Yes, that's, that's yeah. very good. So, so yeah. now, how did he do all that stuff? He basically went to his dashboard and put on the widgets. Can, it's very simple. Like dashboard. Hmm. A dashboard. Oh yeah. Okay. So how do we get to our dashboard? We, we, we log in, right? Yeah. I, except I can't go that way, can I? Go to the top and there's an opening yeah. already. To the right? To right? Nope, nope. The, one, the tab to the right. Hmm. Tab to the right. The one that's already okay. open. So down one. Down, oh. down. Oh. There, oh, no, no, that's not it. Go that's back. Not the dashboard. <laughs> <laughs> okay. There you go. Click dashboard. Yeah, there, there we go. go. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Oh, wow. We can't really see everything. Okay. Well, yeah, that's kind of the problem. It's really hard to see uh, it, I guess. I can fix that. You, you work on that. Ah, uh, well, okay. So oh, as, we're, as we're sort of looking for the dashboard, as we're sort of looking through the dashboard here, on the left side is where we need to go. But um, I, I guess it's sort of missing. Oh, hi. Oh, wait, I disappeared again. I'm back. <laughs> okay, so on the left side, in our dashboard. Here I am. <laughs> <laughs> so let's go back to that dashboard and tell us a little bit about it. Okay, wait. This is so important. I almost fell off the rock just now. Yeah, yeah that's kind of weird. Be careful. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so on the left side here in your dashboard, which you, by the way, have to log in. Who's that man, Tim Owens, at the bottom? Oh, it's someone who made a comment. That's lovely. Oh. Interesting. Oh, wow. There's a whole bunch of things here. It's, it's crazy. So on the left side, we have dashboard, and then we have media, and we have links. And then we can go all the way down to... Wh wh what's that? I plugins, can't read it. Plugins. Oh, okay. Yeah. Great. And then we have a whole bunch of... So different how would you add a plugin? Plugins. What's a plugin? Can you add a new one, please? Okay, so w which one should we? What add? is a plugin? It's a plugin that does more, allows you to add things like the Flickr and the and the tweets into your website. That's so cool. So let's hmm. add a new one. Let's pretend like if we were to add a new. I, oh, I'm getting a handle of this very quickly now. We're gonna add a new tweet. Pick up. Oh, I have to tap. Uh, I don't think he has it. And then we and we and we search for Flickr. Ah, huh. let's try that. Huh. Think something's up. There we go. Oh, ah. and we'll see all of these lovely plugins, galleries, and backgrounds. So what, what did my, my colleague, Pro, uh, Professor Smith, choose? He, he chose, he chose, install. let's look at these installed plugins, and he chose hmm. Flickr Feed Gallery, along with Slicker Flickr. It looks like he's using a couple of them. That's very exciting. So hmm. more let, than one Flickr. Yes. So how does that go? You, 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 you keep going. I was getting a hang of it for a minute, but now I, I've lost my mind. <laughs> okay. So basically, he activated them. That was it. Basically, went back to the plug. Oh. Yes. So he activated a plugin. That's very exciting. And so next, what, 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 what does he have to do after he's activated that plugin? Then you can go to set it up and choose where you want to put it. Well, this one's in a, a widget, so it should go in the, in the widgets, right? Yeah. Oh, no. Oh, so man. So that's under appearance. Oh, man. Appearance? Yeah. Th okay, see, see, I'm having a hard time now. Oh. I, I he cursed it. <laughs> so when you hit a widget, suddenly... Uh-oh. Oh. Oh, there we go. All these widgets are on the sidebar. There's this text. What, the text? He... He just I likes text. Just drag this. Oh, that's not uh, going to no. happen. No. Yeah, let, let me try. There we go. Oh, okay. oh, oh hand. there's hands on the screen. <laughs> there's this Flickr feed gallery. And, and somehow, oh, 
I can't uh -oh. see it now because we're, 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 we have the screen. There it is. Uh-oh. I'm sort of... And we bring a widget to the sidebar, and once it's in there, we're given options. Oh. And this one, this, this, this particular widget has its own settings, right? Under, under settings, Flickr feed galleries comes up, and this is where you have to set it up. You have to set it up to a particular account. My, my account, Mr. Mr. Uh, uh, Smith's account, has this particular uh, ID. This ID uh, can be found by, by typing in. Uh, why don't we type that in? If I, if I put the URL, hmm. switch. Ah. Hmm. Right here, we go to Flickr. Type Flickr, please. Nope. Back. <laughs> there we go. Return. <laughs> ah. Here we go. This is uh, Professor Smith's Flickr account. And I can get that URL. Copy. And go back to that paste. Oh, this is really unbelievable. <laughs> and then paste it in there. And we could say get user ID. There you go. Oh. I think we made a roadblock. Oh. <laughs> there we go. Okay. And we say save. And hopefully I didn't destroy this. <laughs> nope. It looks like it works. I think. Huh. We have to get rid See, of his, his head is like, yeah. Uh, Delete. Professor Olivier. You're, yeah. Paste. Command C. Command B. No, no. Try again. Ah. And it inserts the name. And we say. Okie dokie. Uh, Professor Olivier, you're about to fall off the mountain. Oh, they're still there. That's so good. Okay. So what other important plugins are there that we must learn about? Well, we just did Flickr, right? So there's a Kismet. A Kismet is this fancy plugin I heard to keep the spam away. The comments are the nasty people, and you should look into that one. We also have, a, a, I heard there's a Google Analyticator. Oh, that sounds very fancy. And if huh. you install Google Analytics, you'll have the opportunity to see such a thing as your, your, your site's traffic. Whoa. Oh, Professor Smith has been doing very well. He's gotten the most visitors he's ever had. <laughs> That's amazing. He's very excited. I wonder what he did. Oh, look, look. More <laughs> money. I like this a lot. <laughs> So you can imagine that it's very exciting to have the, these statistics. You could see over time the number of people that have come to your site. Hmm. So on September 19th, uh, the, the, the top number of, of 88 visits. Oh, hi there. Uh, 88 <laughs> visits I've had so far. And that's, that's pretty exciting. Hmm. One of the things I wanted to show, though, is we, we've had, so we have a, a couple other plugins to show. Uh, Twitter Tools is a very exciting tool, uh, plugin, right? I, I, I'm sorry I took your job. It was just, just I'm starting getting these digital tools. It's very exciting. I'm, I'm going to be ready before you know it. <laughs> Twitter tools, it's, oh, yeah, a, it's yeah. a bit difficult to, to, to set up. You'll have to follow some hoops and, 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 and set your I, API key. But you'll, what's an API key? Where did that come from? Hmm, from Flickr, right? Yes. So you'll, but once you, once you have them set, you can do a number of things. Like if I'll go to the settings of, 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 I don't know. If there it's we go. Oh, cool. Twitter tools. You'll see things like enabling to uh, create a post, uh, create a tweet when you blog, which is very, oh gosh, just the mountains showed up. Um, and you can set what will be left there. And the prefix is just new blog post. And, 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 and then it says, uh, but you can change that to whatever you want. And you can even add the, the hashtag um, DS106. Hmm. No, add the hashtag, but that's okay. Okay. The, uh, that's fine. 06. 
blog post. So whenever you set, and we'll scroll down and save, whenever I send out, uh, whenever Professor Smith sends out a, 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 po a post, it's going to be tweeted out. But also he has this lovely ability to, to have his, uh, his, the number of, of, uh, of his tweets to show up in the, in, in, in the, in the where is it again? On the widgets. The widgets, thank you. So he has text, and I think this is where that fancy DS-106 radio thing comes in. Yes, yes, this is some something he, he, he figured out, I, but we don't have to worry about that. And then he has his Flickr feed, Twitter tools, Digo, which is this social bookmarking, and RS, and there's a lot of other things that you can choose from, tag clouds, um, um, there's, we could, we, why don't we add one? Let's add this tag cloud. He, he won't mind, will he? No, I don't think so. I don't, I don't know if I'm going to be able to grab this this way. Which, why don't you get in there and grab that and move it over? Oh. Okay. And where do we want to put it? At the bottom. And we'll leave it with no title for now. And what's exciting is now that in his, his site, at the bottom where he's added that widget, suddenly all the tags that he's ever used on... Oh, oh Jim Groom. Oh, Jim Groom! I've almost forgot about Jim Groom. What about Jim Groom? He's already set off on his journey. He's going to... We have to hurry up. We have to get off on our journey. Mr. Groom, that nasty Mr. Groom, I showed him the entrance to the center of the Internet, and now he's taken it for himself, and he's traveling ahead with his own people. And it was, last week we had a lovely conversation at start. He was so helpful. And then right after that, he just disappeared and it will not talk to us again. And, Maybe and, and what's the prize, though? What's the prize? There's a prize at the center of the Internet? Well, one way or another, we're going to have to get that Jim Groom. It, it's, it's, it's infuriating me. It, I, I can't stand that he took advantage of us. Hmm. So what do we do? How do we get him? Well, we have to, as we start our journey to the center of the inter Internet, we're going to have to make posts about our actions. One of the activities I heard people are doing is they're putting up these lovely pictures in a daily, daily shoot or something. Oh, the, the daily shoot? Yes, they, they, they showed me a, a, a something on the daily shoot. Let me, let me see if I can find that. Oh, there was this lovely site where you... you, you oh, that, no, that's, that's no, not that, No, it's, yeah. Or we can do it here. Type in dailyshoot.com. That's a P. Hmm. Oh, there we go. It's up. That's great. Let's see this. Uh, uh, one of the assignments. So today we have a. Oh, can we see the assignment? Oh, thank you oh. very much. <laughs> so uh, every day you're supposed to take a photo of, 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 upon your journey to the center of the internet, and, and that, that draws it. And today we have to take pictures of something colorful. I haven't done it. Have you? Hmm. Not yet. You but I found something colorful. Hmm. Colory, colory, colory. And and you know, in past assignments we've had. Um, um, we had some students participating. Uh, delete and hit four. Delete, four, return. Some of our students. Uh, there was a make a photograph yesterday that illustrates an idea of connection. And there was this. Uh, one of our, our students made a lovely photograph. Marissa made a. I, I think that's just awesome. It, it really says something about connection. It's almost there, but it's not quite there. They're not quite connected, are they? No. Uh, but that's it's, it's something. It's the idea of connection. Yeah. It's very much that. Idea. Fabulous work. And, and some, uh, another piece of work that I, I was excited about was um, in an introductory post, uh, 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 my colleague, uh, uh, Professor, Professor S Smith, made this post about uh, uh, being in high school. He's such a goofy person, you know, he, he, talking about his, his past like we all would care. Oh, my goodness, look, look, high school <laughs> is everyone's forever ago. And some of the open participants really enjoyed that and started sharing their own uh, big hair photos. That, that's Alan Levine, Cogdog, and... He talked about being ready in the moment when you need to, when you're in the moment, and that was pretty fantastic. We also had, and, and he's out, and well, he's always traveling everywhere. I, I can't say where he is right now. And this is, uh, this is Lou McGill's site, and she was telling us a story about uh, her time from the past, and she's actually out in, in London, you know, very close to me, where I'm in Scotland right now, you know. Hmm. And uh, and finally, <coughs> this is this this is a. Uh, uh, Cheryl Cohen, who's, who's out in, I believe, in Arizona, and she shared us this lovely photo and talking about her past. 
These uh, are the kind of connections that happen when you're in DS-106, right? You know, and, and people share their journeys and, and comment on one another. And that, that's something I'd love to see more of is, is people getting in there and, 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 and commenting. Some of those York students, they really should take advantage of, of, of these lovely participants out in the open and, and, and comment uh, in the same way. But that damn Jim Groom better not show up. <laughs> if he does, I, I swear I will, I will do something back, for him. He's coming back, He better not come back or I swear I, I will do something. We better get started. Is there anything else we need to talk about to get started, to have all your tools together? Hmm. No? Mm. Well, then, here, take this. Okay. I'm, I'm going to get started right now. Here, take this. All check. right. I've got my other tools. And uh, okay. I'm going to oh. Get, get back down the mountain. Oh. 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 Sorry. Sorry. Oh. I think he fell. Sorry. Oh, okay, well, when we find them, I'll let you know. Oh, Goodbye, no, see you till next time. Really? But he said he's not hurt.